Hi everybody and welcome back to Allison Bakes Your Day. This week I am baking my friend Rosalind's Day and she is vegan. Oh, we're doing our first vegan episode! Vegans Unite! Rosalind's favorite flavors that she gave me are butterscotch, pistachio, and cherries. What? Amazing! Haven't gotten butterscotch yet. Very excited. So today we're making a vegan butterscotch pudding with a pistachio vegan shortbread and a cherry sauce to go on top. Let's do it. I'm going to start by grinding up some pistachios. I'm going to coarse grind these as some extra crunch in the shortbread. Let's pulse! Oh, pistachio everywhere. For my next trick, pistachio flour. I'm spying on those pistachios. What are you doing in there? Becoming flour? Please do that. That's what I want. Done with you. Flour. That one. Not you. You're doing so great. You're going to be something delicious. Good job. Pulse to sieve it. Combine the pistachio flour and the regular flour. Castor sugar. So fine. So fine. And, okay, pulse. Now I'm going to add our chunky pistachio. Chunky bits. We've got our flour, pistachio flour, chunky pistachios, castor sugar, cornstarch. We're going to pulse. Pulse. I add half a teaspoon of pistachio extract. While pulsing, we're going to slowly drizzle in our olive oil. Going to give it a nice nutty flavor. It seems kind of wet, but I don't know. It says until you get a soft golden dough. It's golden. It's soft, I think. It's ready. Part of me wants to add more flour, but then a part of me doesn't want to mess it up. We're experimenting with the pistachio. We're going to wrap this up. Still looks really wet to me. Let's stick this in the fridge so it firms up. 30 minutes. I have my brown sugar, water, a pinch of salt in the sauce pan. Basically, we're just making a little caramel. So it looks like butterscotch is basically a brown sugar caramel. I'll let this melt, get butterscotchy, get delicious, scotch it up. Wow, it's bubbly. Don't burn, don't, we're turning this down, turning this down. The sugar was like, I'm ready, let's do this! Bubbly. I already feel like this mixture needs more water. Please don't burn. This is being very finicky. I'm adding a little bit more water because it definitely doesn't look like it's happy. It's already wanting to crystallize off the sides here. Rude. That went a little crazy, went a little off the rails. I'm gonna put more water in, which, I don't know. Just seemed like the right call to me to get that sugar to settle down. Settle down, sugar. Okay, it's gonna simmer. Little tiny peppers. There we go. Simmer, simmer, my friend. Chop, chop, chop. I have our non-dairy milk with some cornstarch um, sitting over here. It's just, just whisked it in there. I am using this toasted coconut almond milk blend because I love it. It's one of my faves. Next step, I have some full fat coconut cream. Pop it in there. As well as our toasted coconut almond milk cornstarch mixture. Oh, come on cornstarch. Ay, ay, ay. Get out of there. Get into there. Bring this back up to medium heat. Come on, back up. Heat back up. Whisk, 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 whisk. Whisk frequently until it thickens. We're gonna whisk this until it gets thick. Oh, here it goes. Ah, it's thickening. Ha -ha! Good, I was nervous about that extra water, but cornstarch, man. Add in our teaspoon of vanilla. Vegan butter. The piece de resistance. A tablespoon of whiskey. This is optional, but I know Rosalind loves bourbon, so I'm adding it because I know she loves it. I'm gonna put the pudding, 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 pudding. I'm gonna put the pudding in here and let it cool to room temperature, and then we'll stick it in the fridge. Moving on. When I took the pistachio shortbread out of the fridge, it was more like just a nut butter. So I added some flour and I stuck it in the freezer to firm up. And that looks a little bit more dough-like. Um, I probably could deal with a little bit more flour, but we'll see, we're experimenting. We're gonna roll this dough out. 
Oh, oh, yep, oh my. <laughs> I don't know. Actually, I think, oof. I do, it just needs, it needs more flour. It's just not, not holding together the way I want it to. I'm gonna have to chill this a little bit more. Need this flour into it. Let's see, did that help? Is that good? Are you okay, shortbread? Are you okay? I think I'm just gonna have to stick this back in the freezer for a little bit. We're going to make our cherry sauce while this is chilling in the fridge because it needs to chill out. I don't feel like dealing with plastic wrap. So I'm just going to stick this in this bag. It's biodegradable. Environment. Back in the freezer. Let's make some cherry sauce, shall we? I've got eight ounces of cherries, fourth cup of sugar, fourth cup of water. We're going to turn this on. Medium heat. I'll let that cook. We're gonna let it boil. Make these cherries into something amazing. Bring the cherries and sugar and the water together. They sound like they're applauding. <gasps> Cherry sauce! Yes! Boil! How's that song go? Hello. Uh, hello. You're my ch 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 cherry bomb! Hello, world. Cherry bomb! Now, since this is boiling, we're gonna add in our cornstarch lemon juice mixture. This is gonna thicken the sauce. And it says bring it back to a boil, but it's not stopping. It's just, you can't stop it. You can't stop an avalanche as it races down the hill. You can try to stop the seasons, girl, but you know you never will. Simmer down. Simmer, simmer down, simmer down. Be careful not to let the bottom scorch. No dragons in your cherry sauce. I'm gonna turn this down too low. Let it simmer, let it cook down. Become something beautiful, amazing, glorious. Take two on our shortbread. Let's try this again. Here we go, much better. Still gonna just do that. <laughs> so this experiment has gone awry. We're, we're just pushing through. We're gonna make this batch. I don't care. Here we go. Okay, that looks better. Nope. Spoke too soon. Spoke too soon. Just gently, just giving it little pats, essentially. Just good dough. That's bad dough. Oh no. We're just gonna do our best. My last video cut off at some point, so I just stuck the shortbread back in the freezer to firm up because it's kind of impossible for me to work with and actually chop it up into shapes and things. So um, in the freezer, we'll figure that out in a moment. Okay. All right, we're gonna work quickly because these things are finicky as hell. All right. Ah! Just kidding, X-Acto knife, be careful. I am going to cut these, probably not evenly. They'll have character. That wasn't too bad. Okay, and we're just gonna do one down the middle. Not exactly, uh -huh. not exact or knifely, but we did it. We're gonna use this to hopefully break this off. Oh, 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 oh. Yes, one and two. Scooch over, scooch over. Make some room for your brother. Uh, uh. Okay, last one. And that one is the one that broke. All right, stick it back together. <laughs> we did it. They're on. They're here. Woo! I thought the shortbread was going to be the easy part. <laughs> We're going to sprinkle some sugar on top. These have to go in the oven for 15 to 20 minutes. Here we go. Wow. Look at those. Don't they look amazing? I hope they are. Oh my God, I hope they are. I'm gonna let them cool on there for a little bit just to get some residual baking out of the way. Then we're gonna put them on this rack to cool completely. The butterscotch pudding has to chill in the fridge for three hours. I will see you when I can assemble these. That's all I got.
See you then. Uh, okay, here we go. Let's shortbread. Ooh, it's very gelatinized. Interesting. It's alive. It's alive. Throw this around. Chill out. Pudding. <laughs> Definitely set in the fridge. It was like, I'm here. I'll take a scoop of pudding. Put it on top. Cherries. That's going to be the money right there. Some fun little layering. It's a little layered dessert. Thank you so much for joining me for Allison Bakes Your Day. I hope I baked your day. Let's see if I baked Rosalind's day. We're about to find out. So you guys were be able to let me eat this. Hey. Okay. You're okay. Mm -hmm. ah, ta, 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 ta. Mm. No. <laughs> this is so good. <laughs> mm. The shortbread is amazing and the cherries, wow. Oh yeah, and that butterscotch just hit too. Ooh. Oh my God, it's so good. Thank you so much, Allison. <laughs> Yummy. Mm. Ooh, no ruby. Mm -mm. Mm. <laughs>